speaker, last week the Global Mail used the phrase Polish concentration camps in reference to the Nazi German concentration and extermination camp in occupied Poland. Brave Polish citizens were the victims of Nazi occupiers and not the predators of their evil crimes. The Globe article was an insult to thousands of Polish righteous among the, among the nations who risked their, their lives to save Jewish neighbors. Can the minister update the House on what our government, government has done to correct the offensive misconception about the existence of Polish concentration camps? Great question. The Honorable Minister of Citizenship and Immigration. Mr. Speaker, I thank the Honorable Member for raising this important and sensitive matter. He's absolutely right that it is offensive uh, to the memory of, uh, uh, of so many uh, Poles who fought the Nazi occupation and invasion. Uh, who were, have been declared righteous amongst the Gentiles uh, to refer to uh, Nazi concentration camps as being Polish ones. That's why the government of Canada has supported at UNESCO the official designation of the Nazi German concentration and extermination camps in occupied Poland. Let there be no mistake, Mr. Speaker, uh, about this point in history. And the government of Canada certainly uh, asks that all people be sensitive uh, to uh, the legitimate historic concerns of the Polish community in this regard. <laughs> Order. Uh, you ought to have a good thing.